Glad you can finally join us. No, I, I just. Doctor West Nolan. Doctor. No, no, it doesn't, doesn't, doesn't ring a bell. I just. We know you lost your memory. Please listen carefully. What am I doing here? And what the hell is on my ankle? Precautions have been taken to ensure you do what's needed. Who are you? I'm Lazarus. So Bethany's just an empty warehouse, right? When you listen to me, Mrs. Lazarus, when I say I don't know, that's exactly what I mean. I don't know! Nothing. I don't remember! I, I, 
I don't... Nothing. I, I don't remember. I just... I'll call you back. What? Hello? Hello? Wouldn't do that if I were you. Do what? Do not try to get out of here. Why? It isn't safe, Wes. Tell me this, can you see me? See and hear you. Why all the bullshit with the phone, huh? I couldn't get connected to the system. Please, Wes, don't do it. We need you in here. I have no idea what the hell you're talking about. Wes? Wes? I tried to warn you, Wes. Shit! We can't let you go. It's dangerous out there. We don't want you to get hurt. Who's we? You married Martha? That is not important right now. What is important is that you understand a few ground rules. Why don't you tell me what the hell the ground rules are? You can move anywhere within the confines of this facility. But any attempt to leave will have consequences. First, the ankle bracelet you are wearing will deliver a thousand volts Shh. to your body. Surely that's enough to keep me here, right? Sadly not. Some of us thought you would require a stronger incentive. What the hell is that? You cross the line and the signal will automatically be sent to our representatives keeping a close eye on your family. Family? How are you talking about family? Look at your left hand. Her name is Leah. She is with your daughter. It's for your own protection. There is a third thing you need to know. Yes. I try to take it off your shock glass again, is that right? So, so, so. Not quite. 
If you make any attempt to temper the bracelet, it will explode and take off your lower half. Why don't you tell me what the hell you want from me, huh? What do you want? You can start by going upstairs. Wes, I'm your ally, not your enemy. Okay. Okay. Fine. I understand you cannot remember. But this is not you against us. We're in it together. We are a team. Our methods may be extreme, but necessary. It's the only way for you to get back your memory. It's the only way for us to get what we paid for and stop this nightmare. I need your help, Wes. Is that? Your new home, and I need you to tell me everything that you know about it. You seem to be forgetting I'm suffering for a little situation of my own. How am I supposed to help you if I can't even recognize my own face? We're willing to take that chance. What if you're wrong? That isn't an option. I'm not going anywhere. You're stuck with me. You said I was your last hope. I didn't say that exactly. Well, it's close enough. Yes, close enough. You tell your associates they're screwed. I don't recognize any of this. I don't know the password. This means nothing to me. It's... I can talk you through what needs to be done. Hopefully that would jog your memory. Not a good start, Wes. If you can't loan me for this, you're out of luck. Okay, I, 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 I... You remember Leah? I mean, you need my family, right? Leah. Tell me, what's my daughter's name? Lonnie. L-O-N-I. Why the hell can't I remember that? Because of the accident. 
You gonna tell me what this place is? What the hell I'm doing here? You are a virologist. Not sure these are the hands of a scientist. I can assure you they are. Do we know each other? Better than you think, but we never met. Why don't you get your ass in here and help me, huh? That's not how this works. No, well, how does it work then? Huh? What if I trash the place? Do you know what is in there? No. Should I? The most dangerous virus known to mankind. You created it. Virus, get out. How many were infected? How many were infected? Calm down, Wes. Please Son calm down. Bitch. It was an accident. How did it happen? It was the fourth Ebola outbreak of 2018. We thought we contained it, but we were wrong. The virus had mutated. Okay, how, what the hell did I have to do with it? You tried to engineer a bacteria that would attack the Ebola before it could destroy the human cells. What do you mean? You tried to save the human race. So what went wrong? Instead of destroying the Ebola, the virus mutated to something we'd never seen before. How bad? Worse than we could have ever imagined. The body count is immeasurable. So the virus leaked out? Because the lab was destroyed. How? How? It's dangerous out there. You have to stay in here. You can still make a difference if you don't die. What? Things have changed. What do you mean, changed? Lazarus. Don't do it. I don't have it. Hey! What is it? Someone else here. That's impossible. You're wasting your time. We need you in the lab. Please, Wes, come back. Please. In time. I'll be the judge of that. What are you doing? Just making shit up as I go. Stop! Stop. 
Stop it! Calm down! Wes. I thought you were dead. How do I know you? I'm Kaylee. How do I, how do I, how do I know you? I'm Kaylee Jorgensen. It was in a car accident, and I, I just... It was a car accident. But I don't, I don't, I don't remember this. Like, what, what where, where am I? What, what, what is this place? It's... I don't know. What do you mean you don't? I, I'm here to help you. Let's get you back to the lab. Come on. I thought Come you... on, now. Found a signal and have located Lazarus. Are you sure? She's in the dark zone. Okay, I'll be right there. I'm here, Mrs. Jorgensen. I'm just here to help. This can only work in our favor. What the hell is she talking about? You really don't know me. No, I don't. I was your assistant. Okay. Do you remember how I created the virus? I don't. I need you to show me. Wonderful. Are you sure she's with him? Where there's Lazarus, there's no one. Right. Come on, they're in the dark zone. We have no other choice. It's a risk we're gonna have to take. Sinclair. I take it you don't know the password, right? Only you know it, security precaution. Any details you can give me that help me remember. What did you name the virus? Flashburn. Named it Flashburn. Well done, Wes. Stop, stop. Let me look at this. Show him, Kaylee. Okay, fine. But you have to wear a mask and gloves. I need to see her arm.
Here. Satisfied? I need you to do exactly as I say. You'll find syringes in the drawer. Open the fridge and take the vial flash burn number seven. Mix it with her blood and see if it turns black. For sure. Something was happening back at Genical. There's a facility lockdown. Genico. You're the lead virologist. There was some sort of security breach, and you insisted that we leave right away. And the men came and they were shooting at us. I thought you were dead, so I ran and I hid for hours. How did we crash my car in a locked warehouse, Kaylee? I... I don't know. I need you to tell me the truth, Kaylee, if you want me to help you. I don't know. Straight to the van, Kelly. Get this 
car started. Milton. I'm on it. So they were using the virus as a weapon. Who, the army? We should get back to work. Don't do it, Wes. Yeah, well, I'm not listening to you anymore. Do not trust her. I'm your only way out. She is manipulating you. She's playing with your emotions. You see your leg. Ankle the other one. Please, Wes, go back. I need you focused on finding the vaccine. out of here once you fix what you have created. Katie. Yep. Someone else is with Lazarus. What do you mean, someone else? A second dot has appeared. Like a glitch? Well, that's what I thought at first, but it moves. Definitely not a shadow image. We'll just be careful when we get there. Thank you. We're gonna need gas. 32 miles ahead of you. How can it be someone else with Lazarus? They are not going to come to the second floor. You know, we're not taking any chances. We are the ones who wanted you here. You wanted out. Maybe so, lady. But I'm having a big problem finding any logic in this at all. This is not about you, Kaylee, or I. The epidemic is spreading fast. The world needs you. Are you Leah? 
Who's Leah? She's my wife. No. I'm Kaylee. How do you feel? What about this? These are red dots. Does that mean anything to you? It means nothing to me. This is an old map. How do you know it's old? The red dots are the infected areas. The blue dots are at risk and the yellow dots, they were safe havens. What do you mean, were? It's not like this anymore. The entire North American continent is contaminated. That's why we don't want you to leave the premises. Yo, I was just out on the rooftop. How did that happen? The rooftop was not a good idea. You may be contaminated. What about this? Any of this? I'm trying, but it just, I just, I, I can't remember. Some of it, but I can't figure out the equations unless I know how you applied them. What about this? Does that help any? Milton. 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 I'm here. Where were you? I have to pee once in a while. Try that in a hazmat suit. Okay. We're at the gas station. I have a visual. Any danger? Area secured. Okay, thank you. We're stepping out.
working. Milton. Everything's okay. Sinclair! Sinclair! Come on! I've been promised. Well, we don't have it! And he does. Guns on the ground. What? You heard what I said. Guns on the ground! What's your name? Dylan McKenzie. I'm Kylie Jorgensen. This is Jack Stewart. And the man you're about to kill is Luke Sinclair. I don't want to kill anyone. I just want the vaccine the government promised me. Are you alone in there? I've proved you my good faith. Are you alone in there? My wife and my daughter are with me. Are they infected? They are. What about yourself? Not yet. Look, we can help you. You just have to trust me. I want the vaccine the government promised me. There is no government. The US Army. What's left of it? Dylan, you have to let us in. Get it! Move! Move it! Move it! Then get in! Move! So, Miss Jorgensen. Call me Kaylee. The fuck is going on? You know as much as I do. I know anything except what I've been promised. Yeah, I got that part. But the people that promised it to you are no longer with us. Where's your wife and daughter? In there. What stage? Terminal, for all I know. You know about the meltdown? Whatever I saw on the TV till all the channels went blank. The first one to give up was Arkansas Nuclear One. It provoked a chain reaction. In a matter of hours, it was followed by the Grand Gulf Nuclear Station in Mississippi, then the Waterford Steam Electric Station in Louisiana, and the South Texas Project in Bay City. A total of 12 nuclear reactors gave up, creating the dark zone. What does this have to do with the epidemic? Because of the meltdown, an experimental virus called Flash Run was released by a secret facility called GenoCal. So it was the government's fault. And hey, we're not here to point fingers. We're not on trial. My wife and my daughter need it now. Look, I, I wish I could help you, but I can't yet. I have no time left. There's a man. His name is Wes Nolan. He's a virologist. He may have the vaccine. Where is he? Deep in the dark zone. 
No one survives the Dark Zone. Our intel says that he's alive. And that's where we're headed now. So you've got two choices. You can kill us and kill your family or let us go. And we bring West back and help them. It's gonna be too late. Maybe. Stop! Stop it! I said stop! Stop! Stop it, please! Stop it, honey! Stop! 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 Stop it! Stop! So what went wrong? The initial tests were successful then. This happened. We don't know why, but the virus and the modified bacteria joined together in symbiosis. What does Flashman do? It takes control of your brain. It makes you do things. Like what? 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 Things does it make you do? Anything to infect other people. A bite, a scratch, a kiss, sex. Then what? It eats you from the inside. Something is going on. What are you talking about? I started noticing a week ago that... ...files are going missing. They're being misplaced. Mm -hmm. The what? color of the vaccine is being different. Why didn't you tell me this earlier? I wasn't sure, so I started to take pictures. Kaylee, this is empty. There's no photos in this folder. There were 349 last night. Just the birthdays, Christmases, my parents' 50th anniversary, they're all gone. Okay, that doesn't mean anything. It doesn't, but this morning I woke up with a severe headache. You want to be one of your migraines? No, it, it, it was so bad that it felt like I was drugged. So I tested myself for Dipper Venom. And? I think they're using a mutated virus as a weapon. This is it. I remember this. This is a vaccine. It's always here. Right in front of your eyes. Then why? 
Where did you find it? on the roof. The fuck is... Why is she... The, the shooters... That's what... I don't... I, I just... Go back to the door now. Okay. 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 Nolan. Nolan, wake up. Hola. Lazarus! He hasn't been responding since you passed out. Nolan! I just... 
just need a minute. Photos were erased. Where did you find it? It doesn't matter. Lazarus must have placed it here. Don't you get it? She's playing with your mind. She doesn't want us to cooperate. Tell me the truth, Kaylee. You have to believe me. You and I both depend on it. I just want the truth. Where is my wife? Right. Lazarus lied about that too. He said I had a wife and a daughter. A family. Something I think she knew I've always wanted. She said she would harm them if I didn't do what she said. This doesn't sound very smart. I know I have a wife. I can feel it. And that feeling gets stronger every single second. But I've never had a daughter. My brain, maybe. But my soul would never let me forget that. Never. Even this is a lie. The indentation on my finger is twice as fat as this piece of garbage.
Position confirmed. Lazarus is in there. Works. It works! It works! You really think we are that stupid? Kaylee. You brought the virus in here and jeopardized our only chance. It's over. Said it. I just, I just forgot where I put it. Where? Don't tell her. Don't listen to Lazarus. Tell me. She is not who she pretends to be. No. Game is up. I remember where it is. You can't threaten me anymore. I would never hurt you. We are the only ones who know how to stop the epidemic. That's why we were running away, Wes. I swear. That's when we found out that Genokel started the epidemic to sell the vaccine to the highest bidder. Lazarus. Not true. They shot at us. You crashed the car. Don't you remember that? Where else? Was it in the warehouse? No. It wasn't in the warehouse. They brought us here when we were unconscious. Don't you realize how ridiculous that sounds? Yes! Kaylee Jorgensen is a foreign agent. Stop it! She's lying and we're gonna die. She will kill you as soon as you find it. I really want to believe you. And I can't give you a reason to, can I? Just go, Nolan. Go by yourself. You don't even need to show me where it is. Just... Just... put a few CCs in this at the bottom of the stairs so that I can live. Once you walk out that door, it's over. You never have to see me again. Nolan. She is playing you, Wes. Don't fall for it. Your daughter. Never forget a daughter. They are here. What do you plan to do with it? They want to stop you. We're not Katie's, right? I need to lock down the facility. Could have told me that a long time ago. You lie to me about my family. I'm not. They are going to kill me. I'm scared, Wes. Open the door!
I need you to stop them. What? They are going to destroy all the hard work we have done. Lazarus! Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the All circuits are intact. It looks like Lazarus resisted the radiations. I hope it worked. Where the vaccine is.
We don't have sound. I just, I need a password. I, 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 just, I can't. You put yourself in the program? Sorry, I couldn't tell you. I'm the computer virus. I'm the glitch that creates controversy, danger, doubt, and love. I put myself into the program to make sure that Lazarus will perform to the maximum of his abilities. To see if you remember something. Wait, wait, slow down. Slow down. I really want to believe you. And I can't give you a reason to, can I? What's going on? Go by yourself. You don't need me to show me what it is. Just... Just... Put a few cc's of this at the bottom of the stairs so that they can live. It's not his fault, Callie. It's that part of him is dead. Just fast forward. What the hell? Where is it? In the car! We already searched the car. Extensively. It's in the driver's seat! Should I disconnect Lazarus? Not yet. Not until Melton finds the vaccine. You give me a moment. Sure. I know you can hear me. And you probably want answers by now. We stole the vaccine when we found out what Jenna Cowell was going to do with it. I don't know if the rest of the world even knows what Jenna Cowell is, but I do.
after the accident. You never recovered. You weren't dead. But you weren't alive. And the vaccine was gone forever. That was until Jenna Cal contacted me and asked me to create Lazarus, a program that would jolt your memory and record it. They figured only someone who knew you as well as I did could complete this task. Since then, you've been wandering through a world that I've created for you. Every time you hit a dead end, it would reboot itself. Until... Until this moment. Twelve days after Jenna Cal moved you to a secure location, the big meltdown happened. The virus was set free and the epidemic spread like a tsunami all over the world. We needed the vaccine more than ever, but the Genical facility was destroyed, and you and Lazarus were lost until this morning. You gotta do it now. No, he's here. They found out two days before the crash. They named her Lonnie. It was the only time they've ever seen me cry. He won't make it long, though. We can't leave him here. What? We have to take him with us. We have to.
Oh, Wes, how romantic. A daughter? A wife who saves you? What else? I've been programmed to know you like happy endings, but that was a bit over the top. Don't you think? It's only you and I. You won't get out of here until I get the vaccine. Therefore, I suggest we start all over again. <laughs>